Hey guys, what's up? Good morning. I hope uh, everyone is doing fine in this lockdown. So today we have come with the uh, second video with our home gym tools. So today's uh, exercise is for our chest and shoulders for those uh, muscles. So what we do here is like uh, we need to get a tool which is cost around 600 to 700 and you can get that in any sports shop uh, to give a small note about this tool uh, this tool has been uh, widely used in Esther ear films mostly you could see uh, in our CID J Shankar's movie okay so uh, this we call it as some as a chest expander okay and uh, so this is the one I'm talking about so this is the newly modified one okay so I'll show you the old one also which we used to uh, do uh, earlier. So this is the old one. Uh, so you can see the tension of the string is little big and since it's little bit old I'm not taking this one. I'm taking uh, the demo with the new one. Okay. So let's start with the first exercise. Uh, so that's the basic exercise with the chest expander. So what we will do is like uh, we have to expand this string out, out, outwards and while expanding it you have to breathe in and while contracting it you have to just relax okay and while contracting you shouldn't uh, leave the uh, tension fully means you have to keep some pressure in the string so I'll show you how to do So like this you can do 10 numbers uh, like 2 sets or 3 sets as per your health. So this is the first exercise. So what you need to do is just push, push it outside. So while pushing outside take your breath in and while come, um, relaxing leave the breath out. So, This helps in building your chest. Uh, if, if you want to uh, build your chest without going to gym, so this is the tool which you can uh, get it in your sports shop. So let's move to the second exercise. So the second exercise we call it as an archer kind of exercise. So uh, this is something like how you hold the bow. Okay. So uh, what it does is it, it just it builds your triceps so what you need to do is just hold it like a bow and bring back like a string so while bringing it back breathe in and while relaxing breathe out So like this you can do uh, 10 reps in, in each side and you can do 3 to 4 sets. So now let's move to the third exercise. The third exercise is for your shoulders. So this will help you in bringing a big round shoulder for you. Um, so what you need to do is like you, you can just, you to, I'll, I'll, I'll show you how we can do. Okay, so bring your arm behind and bring your chest expander like this. Hold the chest expander like this with, with your top, thumb at the top and the other four fingers down and you can do a workout like this so this gives a better uh, tension to your shoulders so you can do uh, like uh, uh, it's the same like two sets with uh, 10 repetitions each okay so now let's move to the uh, the fourth exercise so that is for your shoulders again uh, so that will help you uh, means it's similar to a shoulder uh, flies so that will help you to uh, do the shoulder flies without the dumbbells or anything okay so what you do is like uh, you have to bring your chest expander down and uh, I'll show you how to do the exercise uh, 
Okay, so what you do is like keep your chest expander like this and So you have to do like the same like uh, uh, two sets with 10 repetitions each. Uh, so this gives a better contraction to your shoulders. Now we will move to the fifth exercise. So the, the fifth exercise is to your traps and your back. So what you do is like uh, bring the chest expander to the top. Uh, expand like this. Let's keep the chest expander like this. Okay. And what you need to do is like expand it out. So uh, don't relax it fully, keep the uh, tension in the string. So this gives a better workout to your traps. So now let's move to the sixth exercise. So the sixth exercise is like you keep your chest expander like this and expand one arm outside. So this is also like for your shoulder, I mean for your uh, chest. So this brings a better contraction to, to your chest. So while bringing it in, don't release the tension fully. Keep the tension on, and you'll feel the uh, means uh, the contraction in your chest. Yeah. So let's move to the seventh exercise. So that's for your biceps. So using this chest expander, you can do your biceps workout. So I'll show you how to do that. Okay. So what you need to do is like um, keep your uh, I mean, leg a little bit fine and put the uh, one end of the chest expander to your feet and just bend it and uh, so it gives a good contraction uh, to your uh, biceps. So this I would recommend you to do the same like uh, two sets with 10 repetitions each. Let's move to the eighth exercise with this chest expander. That's for your hips. Okay. Uh, so uh, what you need to do is like uh, you have to keep the chest expander down. I'll show you how to do. Okay. So uh, keep the chest expander down. Uh, put one end both your legs in. Okay. And what you need to do is just hold your uh, arm a little bit to any of your um, nearby object, window or a wall, okay? Then lean a little bit one side and just expand the uh, leg outside. So this gives a better contraction to your hips. So you can do this exercise for your like two sets, 10 repetitions each. So now let's move to the ninth exercise. So this is an add-on which they have provided in my chest expander. I think in most of it, it won't be there. So this is that's the one which I'm showing outside. So this uh, this is for your uh, means your fingers. So hold your uh, means uh, expander like this and just bring it in. So this gives uh, a better uh, means workout for your uh, means your finger muscles. Okay, so you get, you'll get a better finger muscles if you do this like that. So uh, with this we have come to the end of today's session. Uh, so hope you would have uh, everyone would have enjoyed. Uh, watching it and could have learned how to do the workout with this chest expander. So, uh, so during I know this is a tough period. So I recommend you to stay safe and stay healthy.